this time in the bullet hole. It's breakfast time in the bullet hole. Won't you eat some food with me? Eat some food. Solely wants to eat. Solely wants to eat. Yes, son. I know you'll leave the cameraman. You shall leave the cameraman. But mom is wearing a robe and I don't want to be filmed because that would be so very weird. Then why are you doing that? Because I learned it from you. You're always running around in your underwear. Not what you love. Big baby. All right, what are you guys gonna eat? We're gonna eat mac and cheese. Mac and cheese, mac and cheese for breakfast. No, we're out. Then we're gonna eat pops. Pop cereal. Pop, 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 pop cereal. See this pile of clothes? Those, that's our clean clothes pile. We also have a huge clean clothes clean clothes pile upstairs that needs to put away. I got so much things to put away. I got so much things to put away. It would be very impressive for just one seven year old boy. Kevin cleaned his room a few days ago, which is a rarity, and it has been cleaned for how many days now? Four? Five? He's gonna keep it clean for 30 days. For incentive, of course. Amber, your room's clean except for mom's clean clothes that I need to put away in there. I think, isn't it? Isn't it my mess that's in there? This is a very good morning. Um, seven year old boys, do this for your moms. You'll get great, great rewards. Okay, we're entering the best place in the whole entire world. My mom wants it, and so do I. It feels actually peaceful. This! A clean room. It's been clean for about four days. See? My leopard gecko's cage, he's in his hide. Worms I'm keeping to waste. They're doing really good on the racing. Yep, my room is clean. It's double, double clean, clean, double clean. Now, I made this sign so everybody would stay out. No, no, no parents, no sisters. Yeah! Yeah! Girls, yeah! never fight. It's terrible. It's a terrible, terrible idea. Eat, eat. Okay, that's eat, eat. What do you want to eat? Do you want to see what I eat for breakfast almost every morning? I get some frozen berries. My sister got me hooked on this and I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. I should cut this part. It's not singing. So I just. I defrost some berries. I take a look at Cave and eat his pops. Pops, pops. Hi, Soli, is that yummy? Look what I did. Darn it, now I gotta mess this thing up. It's good that I eat off of the ground. Yeah, it's good to eat off the ground, you get grossy. I said, okay, I gotta go to bed. Our ground's probably the last ground you should eat off of. I said, okay, I'll go, I gotta go get a broom and sweep this up. And everybody's like, no, I'll eat it. She's a gross child. But we love, 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 love her. So then I get my berries. I put some Greek yogurt on top. Mmm, great yogurt, blueberry. 
and then I sprinkle a whole lot of cinnamon on top. Cinnamon. No, cinnamon's good for you. So that's what I ate for breakfast. It's delicious. How's your guys' breakfast of pops? Pop, 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 pop. Okay, when your pops are done, you can have yogurt. They pop into your addiction. Is that right, Swole? Yeah. Uh huh. Hey guys, I just got done dealing with a major poo fiasco. Ugh. Ugh. So. One of my kids, I won't name any names, used way too much toilet paper and clogged my toilet. So I tried to flush it and out it spewed all the disgustingness all over the floor. So I was sucking it up with my Hoover wet vac or whatever it is I have. And I was cleaning it and I'm in the middle of this mess trying to get things clean and not contaminate anything else or myself. When Embry's yelling at me from the other bathroom, she's in the bathroom using that toilet. And her baby sister decided to go poop in her potty chair and she wanted to dump it. So she's trying to dump it while Embry's sitting on the toilet. So I had to deal with that and come back to the mess that's taken care of. It's definitely not fun times, but it's over. So I just talked to, everyone called me today. I feel so happy about it. My sister Jamie called, my sister Crystal called, my mama called. Anyway, my sister was telling me that her boy Bryce watches our vlogs. So Bryce, if you're watching this, Auntie Cassie loves you. <laughs> anyway, uh, about 40 minutes till my dearest Shay comes home. And then it's Friday, we're gonna party. Okay, I don't really know if we're gonna party. Shay does work tomorrow, but we like to treat Fridays like Fridays should be treated. So we'll probably do something fun. Hey, bro. Wah, 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 wah. Wah. I want daddy. Daddy gonna be home soon. Let me kiss your cute nose. What smells like fondant? Maybe my lip gloss? <laughs> smell it, smell it. Does it smell like fondant? Anyway, it's a wonderful day in the neighborhood. And the fish are still alive. My fish are still alive. They're doing and well. And so is Kuka. Kuka, Kevin's lizard. Kuka, Kevin's lizard. That's all he wants in his business. That's all he wants up in here in his business. Yeah. Yeah. Crazy hair. That's a cool little baby with crazy hair. Remember when her hair was only like this? Yeah, she was a baldy. She was a baldy, baldy. Oh, so fun fact about me. I love, love, love celebrating my kids' birthdays. Hi, boys! <laughs> and I love throwing big parties. I used to think they were somewhat extravagant parties until I got on Pinterest. Then I realized that they're not very complex parties. But I still love throwing big parties. And I'm in the process of planning this girl's second birthday party. She's gonna have a doggy birthday. Hey, we better stop planning Kuka's too. Yeah, that's you, bro. Kuka, I mean Kuka. This guy, Kaven, not Kuka. Kaven's gonna throw his lizard a birthday. Yeah, in it's August. only in three months. Woohoo. So she, this little baby's gonna have a doggy party because she loves doggies. This is my oh, monkey cuddles. This is Cuddles. Cuddles had a mishap with the road once. He's got a jacked up mouth. Right after Embry got him for Christmas from Santa Claus, I sat him up on the hood of our Suburban while I was loading kids or something, and, well, I guess she. And Cuddles, this monkey, moves all on her own, and she jumped off the hood. No, no, she slipped, and then she, bam, fell on her nose. Fell right on her nose. <laughs> but she it's forgives healing. us. It's healing. Bye-bye. So good. What about you, Cape? 
another bull only day hope you enjoyed our video seems like all we ever do is eat 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 thumbs up this video if you like to eat and we we like you keep watching peace out loves